Yo, what is going on guys? In today's video, we are talking about the 10 most tryhard 800 V-Bucks skins in Fortnite. This video was highly requested by a lot of you guys in the comments, so I thought it was time I made it a video. Before we get into it guys, if we can reach 30,000 subscribers in the next few days and 2,000 likes on this video, I'm going to be gifting you your favorite 800 V-Bucks skin. As soon as we hit 30,000 guys, I will be gifting five of you your favorite skin and I will be giving you a shout out in the next video. So make sure to go down, smash that subscribe button so we can reach 30,000. Go down, hit that like button so we can smash that 2,000 like goal. Comment your epic name and your favorite 800 V-Bucks skin so I can gift you. But let's get straight into the video. <laughs> Coming in at the number 10 spot, guys, we have Crystal. Yes, Crystal coming in at number 10. Crystal is a really awesome skin and used to be the most tryhard skin in Fortnite. I actually made quite a few videos where this was by far the most popular tryhard skin in the game. But unfortunately, since then, it has definitely dropped off. Since ever about Chapter 2, Season 3 started, it has dropped off. And now that we are in Chapter 2, Season 4, it has dropped off a lot. It is still a really clean skin. It looks awesome, but I think it's just been so overused that people don't want to run it more. There are still a few pro players and streamers that use this from time to time, but it isn't really anyone's main skin anymore. There are a lot of brand new tryhard skins that people are using, and unfortunately, Crystal has just dropped off a little bit, but definitely deserves to be in at the number 10 spot. Coming in at the number nine spot, guys, we have a pairing of skins, and this is Whiplash and Slingshot. The reason I'm pairing these two skins together is because they are very, very similar. They pretty much have the exact same design, just with two different colors. Also guys, make sure to let me know in the comments down below which style you prefer. Do you prefer the yellow Whiplash skin or the blue Slingshot? Personally, I think Slingshot is a better skin out of the two, but both of these are very tryhard in Fortnite. They don't really get the use that I think they deserve. They are really awesome, really well designed, and you can make some really awesome combos with these. I see a lot of people using Slingshot with the studded axe, and it works so, so well. I really like Slingshot. Whiplash is a really awesome skin too. I think it's just a little bit older, so it has dropped off a little bit, but I am seeing quite a few people using this Slingshot skin, which is absolutely awesome. Moving on to the number eight spot, guys, we have Bracer. Yes, Bracer coming in at the number eight spot. Bracer is a really awesome skin and this is definitely one of the most slept on skins in Fortnite, guys. This is a really awesome skin. I think it is so underrated as well. I don't really know why this doesn't have the respect it deserves in the community. It is a really well-designed skin and has some really nice colors on it. And there are actually pro players that use this in tournaments. So I don't know why this continually gets slept on in the community, but it is definitely a skin to look out for. I don't think it will ever be a top three tryhard skin in Fortnite, but it definitely has potential to be a top five skin. I think this is awesome. Definitely gets slept on. And if you guys want a really underrated tryhard skin, then this is the skin for you. Moving on to the number seven spot, guys, we have Aura. Yes, Aura coming in at number seven. Aura is obviously one of the most famous tryhard skins in the game, and he's in a very similar position to Crystal. It has obviously dropped off a little bit ever since Chapter 2 Season 3 started, and now that we are in Chapter 2 Season 4, it has just got less and less popular as the season has gone on. Obviously, there are so many people that still use this skin, and it returns to the store like every two weeks. So if you guys want a really popular tryhard skin, then Aura is the skin that you want to pick up. It is awesome. You can make some really nice combos with it. And I think it's just died off a little bit because people used it so, so much. So if you've never used this skin before and want to get a tryhard skin, I would definitely recommend this. It also has an edit style as well. So if you guys either prefer the long sleeves or the short sleeves that is completely up to you and that's what I like about these really cheap skins a lot of them actually do have edit styles so if you guys 
get sick of the base version, you aren't having to pay a lot of V-Bucks to get a really awesome second version as well. And Aura has definitely been a top three tryhard skin in Fortnite, but just the fact that it has dropped off a little bit has pushed it down to the number seven spot. Moving on to the number six spot, guys, we have another very slept on skin, and this is Clash. Yes, Clash coming in at number six. Clash is an awesome skin. It has some really well-designed features of it, and I really think this should be a more popular tryhard skin. There are quite a few pros that use this, and this is a really awesome skin, you guys. You can make some really good combos with it. It doesn't have a lot of bright colors or anything like that, but it definitely has a bit of a mix-up. It doesn't always have to be a really bright colored skin, but it just has those little flashes of bright colors in the hair, which I think is absolutely awesome. Another reason why I like this is the fact that it is wearing a beanie. I mean, that is so cool. You don't see too many skins in Fortnite with beanies on. The only other one that I can think of is Aura, and that is also a very tryhard skin. Let me know in the comments down below, guys, if you have the Clash skin, because I think it is absolutely awesome. And if we can smash 30,000 subscribers in the next few days, I will definitely gift some of you guys the Clash skin. Moving on to the number five spot, guys, we have the Banner skins. Yes, Banner skins coming in at at number five. These are obviously very similar to the superhero skins, which literally just got released, but these are a very cheap alternative to those skins. The banner skins were some of the first customizable skins in the game. This allows you to put your own emoti con, whatever they're called. I was going to say emoji, but your own emoticon onto the skin. You can obviously change the colors of the shirt as well. You can't do anything like you can on the superhero skins where you can change pretty much everything about them. This is just very basic customization, and I think it is really good. So for 800 V-Bucks, you have a skin with endless possibilities. If you want to have a black colored t-shirt on and then you get sick of it and want to have a red colored t-shirt on, you can do that. And that is what I love about this skin. As I said before, you know, you don't want to be paying too much for skins that are very, very limited in the options that you get. But with the banner troopers, guys, you get unlimited possibilities for only 800 V-Bucks, which is an absolute bargain. Moving on to the number four spot, guys, we have the Scarlet Commander. Yes, Scarlet Commander coming in at at number four. I love the Scarlet Commander. It is definitely one of the better designed skins in the game. And this is definitely a skin for the really tryhard people. A lot of these other skins are used by a Eh, sometimes bots, but the Scarlet Commander is one skin that only tryhards use. It is a really well-designed skin. A lot of bots don't pick this up because I guess they just don't think it looks that cool, but a lot of tryhards see the potential in this skin and know that there are some really awesome combos out there that you can make with the Scarlet Commander. I think it is one of the better designed skins in the game, and for only 800 V-Bucks, guys, you are getting a really well-designed skin. So if you're looking Looking for a definite tryhard skin, the Scarlet Commander is the skin for you. Moving on to the number three position, guys, we have the Brute Gunner. Yes, Brute Gunner coming in at number three. I don't think the Brute Gunner has ever featured on the channel before, but it is definitely one of the best tryhard skins in the game. There are a few reasons why I love the Brute Gunner skin, and this is basically because it refers to the biggest meme in Fortnite, which were the Brutes or the Mechs, if you guys call them that, all the way back in Season 10. They were the big robots that went around the map. You either hated them or you loved them in Fortnite, and a lot of people that I know absolutely hated them, but I love the fact that they brought out these Brute Gunner skins, and they were instantly some of the most popular skins in the game. Again, they have died down a little bit. You don't see too many people using them anymore, but whenever you come across someone using the Brute Gunner skin, guys, you know they are going to be tryhard. It is a really awesome skin and definitely a skin that you guys should pick up. Moving on to the number two position, guys, we have Bullseye. Yes, Bullseye coming in at number two. Bullseye has three different styles, you guys, and that is why it is so popular in Fortnite. 
you aren't being forced to use a skin that you guys don't like. You literally have the choice between three different skin styles. However, only two of these are going to be tryhard, guys. These are the tech version, the brand new blue version of the skin that just came out and the Pixel Heart variant. Obviously, Pixel Heart has obviously died down a little bit. You hardly see anyone using this skin, but tech variant of Bullseye, guys, is so popular. I see so many people using this. As soon as it got released, it was by far the most popular skin in the game. There were heaps and heaps of people running around with the tech skin in every single lobby, and I absolutely loved it. I've been using it a lot lately and cannot love it anymore. It is so, so perfect, and you guys are going to love it. Unfortunately, the default or the base version of the skin isn't really tryhard in Fortnite, but you guys can definitely make some good combos if you like this style. However, it isn't really considered as tryhard as the other two styles. But moving on to the number one spot guys, the most tryhard 800 V-Bucks skin in Fortnite is Manic. Yes guys, Manic coming in at the number one spot. All of you guys should have seen this coming. Manic has been one of the most popular tryhard skins in Fortnite history and so many people have been using it lately. It did die down a little bit in Chapter 2 Season 3, but it has had a resurgence in Chapter 2 Season 4 with nearly everyone using this skin. It comes back to the store so, so often, so if you guys haven't already picked this up, this will definitely be coming back soon. And guys, if we can smash 30,000 subscribers in the next few days, I will definitely be gifting some of you the Manic skin, so make sure to go down and comment your Epic Games names down below. Man Manic is a really awesome skin. As soon as I picked up this skin, guys, I used it for like a month straight. I loved it so much. You can make some really awesome combos with it. The Harley Hitter and the Cactus Jack are always going to be my favorite Manic combos. I think they just look so clean and so, so tryhard. But there you guys go. That is my video for the 10 most tryhard 800 V-Bucks skins. Let me know in the comments down below how many of these 800 V-Bucks skins you have and what your favorite one is. I'm really excited to see what you guys say. Personally, I think my favorite is Slingshot, The Brute Gunner, Bullseye, and Manic. Thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you all in the next video. Peace.